Hey guys, how's it going? So I want to go ahead and do my video today for the uh, Suavecito mix up with the Universal Monsters uh, collection. Uh, I got those a few weeks back, maybe about a month ago now when they released. Uh, I don't know if you guys saw my video where I went to the drop party. Uh, I had a good time. You see the poster right there for it. Uh, I covered what I got at the event, but I didn't actually cover the actual pomade. So this video, we're going to go ahead and do each one separately. Um, sorry. So let's go ahead and start with the first one. Okay, first up, we're going to do the original hold. So the original hold from this set was the Dracula one. So what they went ahead and did was they... They had the label going uh, with the Universal Monster Dracula. I don't know if you guys have known, know the old school Dracula. Get that artwork is really good. I like it a lot. So if you guys can see the label, it's kind of got the font for like the old monster movies, which I like. So this one is just, just your basic standard original hold uh, Suavecito product. So you guys smell it. If you guys are able to get any of that, it's just your basic hold. Standard, I like it a lot. Always a go-to. Um, again, it's obviously nice to have in the in the collector tin. So the original hold met with the Dracula. Next, we have the... Next in the collection out of the four, we have the Stronghold. So the Stronghold went to Frankenstein. So Frankenstein is your big, strong guy. Not too bright, but definitely uh, definitely a on the stronger type. So maybe that's why they went with the Stronghold for him. So once again, uh, everything is your basic Suavecito product. Uh, smells still the original. I've been using this one a lot with my hair being longer and pretty thick. It, I definitely need the Stronghold uh, for most of the day. I do, I do pair it with the uh, grooming spray to give it that extra hold. So if you guys can see this on the label, kind of got the electricity going on in the background from the old Universal stuff. Same thing. So the artwork is really good on the labels. I like these really well. The container is actually a gray, if you guys can see that. So definitely fits in well with the collection being that it's a different color tube. So next up out of the uh, Classic 4 set, we have the... Thank you. We have the matte finish. So the matte finish went to the creature from the from the Black Lagoon. So if you guys have ever seen that, um, creature from the Black Lagoon is a green guy. So that's why container is green. So if you can see from the label, the background is a swamp. Font is from the original 19, I think 20s or 40s, whenever that came out. Uh, posters, fonts, same way. So this, if you guys have ever used a matte finish pomade, You'll know what it's you know what it's about. It's got that white that white pomade to it. Scent is still the original, so you can see it's the white one. Use this a couple of times. It works really well. It's it's your standard matte pomade from these guys that works great. Uh, so again, if you guys have used it in any any of their other ones, same product, just uh, you know, classic collector container. So if you guys haven't got one of these, if you're looking for it, uh, I definitely recommend getting this one if you're a big fan of the matte pomade. Uh, it's definitely good for the collection. And then last but not least in the collection, thanks, sir, we have the Firm Clay. Now, I was kind of surprised they did this because they just had brought out the Firm Clay this last year. So to see them do another style with it, I thought was pretty cool. So that just means it's going really well for them selling it. So the Firm Clay belonged to the Mummy. So if you guys haven't used their Firm Clay yet, um, I recommend it. I have their original one that came out uh, earlier in the year. The Firm Clay, as you guys can see, it's got a pinkish color to it, almost like a different clay. So uh, it's a great product. Scent, scent smells like the original uh, Suavecito scent, so that's what I do like. The original clay, let me see that. Thank you, sir. So the original clay was this one. I don't know if you guys have gotten this one yet. So it's the exact same product from there into their mummy collection which i thought was pretty cool that you when you think of the clay you'd you'd add the mummy so i like this the artwork's really nice and detailed on the top 
Same thing on the sides from the old uh, early 19, I think 20s or 30s, or maybe, I don't know, I think it may have been the 50s. I think it's more of the 50s for these things, yeah. So like the 50s monster movies from the Universal Black and White. Font matches perfectly with the mummy, what they were doing back then. So that's all four that came in the set. Uh, like I said, I went to the launch party, went and picked up a couple of items, picked up a comb, uh, a couple other things. Uh, I did pick this up today. I've seen this a bunch of times. And I finally decided to break down and get the switchblade knife uh, or switchblade comb. Works really well. Actually goes through the hair really nice. So uh, I like that. So like if you guys can see, I was definitely at the uh, Black Friday deal today. So you see in the background, I got my ugly sweater from these guys. Super excited about. Uh, so so yeah. So we're going. So if you haven't gotten any of these in the set, I highly recommend doing it. It's a great set, uh, great collaboration with these two. So again, you got you got your stronghold, which is your your Frankenstein, your original hold, your Dracula in the red container, your matte finish, creature from the Black Lagoon in the green container, and your firm clay, which is the mummy. So thanks for watching. See you guys next time.